Are you thinking about a vise for tying larger flies? One that will hold a hook without slippage? Well, the Saltwater Traveler Series vise is the vise for you. This vise is available in right or left hand models and it will comfortably hold hooks ranging from size 4 up to size 8 R. And if you buy the optional standard Traveler vise head or the components for the vise head, you will be able to tie it down to size 28 simply by changing out the vise head assembly or swapping out the parts. Let's take a closer look at the Rinzetti Saltwater 2200 series and see what sets it apart from the rest of the Traveler vices. The first thing is that it comes with this material clip, but more importantly it has this spinning attachment knob for true rotation at faster speeds, but most importantly is this beefy jaw system that beefy jaw coupled with this 45 degree patented offset that Andy Renzetti designed is what gives you this kind of clamping power. Now this is a standard set of traveler jaws with a 2 aught hook and you can see I can just bend this wire right down around. Well you have that same capability right up through to 8 aught with the Traveler Series salt water jaws. Andy Renzetti started out in vices with this collet style and he brought the collet style to a pinnacle with the Presentation 3000, but he realized that if he wanted true clamping, he was going to have to go to the cam action jaws that you see in these Traveler Series vices. Now this particular saltwater head only has two sets of holes. The upper hole accommodates two aught to eight aught hooks, and the bottom one size four to two aught hooks. Let's take a look at the conversion process if you had a standard traveler and you wanted to uh, swap out the complete head assembly. First you'd tighten the, uh, the stem uh, or clamp the stem if you have a pedestal, clamp the stem with something and then turn this head loose. It's just an Allen screw that goes down through to uh, hold it in place and you can see the Allen screw sticking out of the bottom of this saltwater head assembly and you just uh, screw this whole complete assembly back on. Or not back on, you'd be putting it on for the first time having removed the standard head. Now let's make this same conversion again from a standard traveler to a saltwater head, but this time just the components. I've got a bent stem, a material clip, and a jaw from a saltwater unit here and I'm going to take the components out of this standard traveler. Uh, as I take these out, you'll notice I'll take off one at a time and I'll lay these down in order so that when I put it all back together, all I have to do is reverse the order of assembly. There's also a diagram of this that came with your vise if uh, you should get the parts mixed up. Get this piece off and take off this uh, Teflon washer and then we'll just loosen the uh, tensioning uh, stem screw bobbin out of the way just slide this out see the similarity except for the jar of course that is uh, so much bigger this just slides in and uh, this is the uh, the bent shaft for the saltwater jaw, the saltwater jar itself, and the material clip. That's the minimum you need to convert over from a standard traveler head assembly uh, to a saltwater head assembly by swapping components. All of these parts going back on are the regular traveler assembly pieces. And the only difference is you're not going to have a spinning knob at the end of this, or I'm not going to have when I put this on because uh, uh, I'm showing you the minimal pieces that you need to make this change. Uh, personally, if it was me, I would order the components including the spinning knob because it does make uh, the rotation uh, true rotary rotation much faster and you can use that spinning knob attachment on your standard traveler as well. So you see I put it all back together and uh, I've got it uh, fairly loose. I'll tighten it up with my tension screw and there we are. I've converted over from the standard to a saltwater traveler and uh, like I said I don't have the spinning knob on there but uh, 
this is the saltwater traveler this is what it's all about the 2200 series is a, a size 4 to 8 aught clamping vice set and the adaptability and changeability of this vice system the whole traveler series of vices from the clouser head to the saltwater head back to the traveler standard head and back to the clouser again if you want to is all a simple process and it's something that Renzetti has done to make their tools and equipment more versatile for you the user